I started writing these vows, the thought of standing in front of 130 people slightly terrified me. But the more I started to write, and the more feelings started pouring out, I realized I had nothing to worry about. I'm standing beside you, my best friend, on our wedding day, looking in your eyes and telling you how much I love you. Loving you is the easiest thing in the world. And I could talk about this specific topic for hours and hours. And honestly, most people here are probably used to hearing me talk about how much I love you for hours and hours. <laughs> fight what we can't see I don't know but I'm trying It's me tonight in our dreams Baby why don't you lie down Time is up Only in a me Andrea is such a warm and fundamentally kind person and it's obvious to everyone who meets her that she cares deeply about the people in her life just like Brayden does For almost 15 years now Brayden has been talking about wanting a family and seeing the two of you together today, it's clear you finally found the perfect person to do just that. You bring out the best in each other and you've built such a warm and inviting home in Hamilton that's become the go-to gathering place for all of our friends. We can't wait to see what's next for the two of you. We love you both and we're so excited to be part of the next chapter of your lives. So here's to you, Brayden and Andrea, to all the adventures you've had and all the ones yet to come. <laughs> Andrea has been ready to marry Brayden for a long time. They have been deeply connected since the beginning. As their roommate and basement tenant, I have always admired the way they communicate with each other. Andrea bringing her mediating middle child skills to the relationship and Brayden bringing his steady patience. And thank goodness I'm there because I end any stall disagreement with my expert tie-break opinions. These two love to have fun, which might seem obvious, um, but they're so good at it. If you've ever been to one of the theme parties at their house, you know what we're talking about. Their love for adventure sent them portaging together, culminating in a beautiful proposal, and their friends and family know that they're always down for a good time. They love each other fiercely, and we are so excited to see what awaits them in their future. In the car, I just can't wait To pick you up on the very first day Is it cool if I hold your hand? Is it wrong if I think it's lame to dance? Do you like my stupid hair? Would you guess that I didn't know what to wear? I'm just scared of what you think You make me nervous so I really can't eat Brayden, loving you is the easiest thing in the world. I thought writing these vows would be difficult but as it turns out, I've been writing versions of vows to you in my mind since the moment we met. It was only four years ago that the stars aligned for us, but it feels like I've known you for a lifetime. You are my safest harbor, my voice of reason, my comfort, and my joy. When we first started to get to know each other, I remember thinking how easy it felt to open up to you. It has always been the most natural act to love you. Life has not always been easy, but I draw strength and comfort from knowing I have you and you have me. To be standing here with you today, committing to a lifetime of all that love, makes me the luckiest person in the world. Today, and always, I choose you. To love you, to cherish you, to respect you, to encourage you, to strengthen you, to celebrate you, to support you. This little life that we're building together is the sweetest one I could ever imagine. You're the love of my life and I promise to love you for the rest of our days. I'm not worthy 
Andrea, today is the best day of my life. I am so excited that we get to spend this day celebrating our love with all of the people in our lives who are most important to us. I love our life and this little world that we're creating together. Even standing here now, trying to keep it together, I can't stop looking in your eyes. Honestly, I kind of have to breathe. <laughs> your eyes tell me every day that I'm home and that I'm loved. I can't wait to wake up to these eyes every morning and fall asleep to them every night. And then there's your laugh. Trying to make you laugh is one of my favorite hobbies. I don't always succeed, but when I do, it is one of my favorite parts of the day. Your laugh is one of the best sounds in the world. You laugh with all of your being in such a pure, joyful way. It is so contagious. If Paige didn't have to cut me off, I could spend hours telling you how much, how amazing you are and how much I love you. But that's okay, because we have a lifetime together, and I promise to never stop telling you how much, how amazing you are, and how much I love you. Right now, I'm so ready to kiss you and walk down this aisle as husband and wife. So please, let's do that. <laughs> Brayden, it's so important that you know that in all the years we've known Andrea, we've never seen her happier than when she's been with you. You bring out the absolute best in her and you challenge her in all the right ways. And I think all of us could agree that we couldn't have imagined a better partner for our best friend. Very recently on four days notice, Andrea and Brayden just dropped everything going on in their lives, including planning a pretty beautiful wedding. Uh, to just help us with the birth of our son who had come a few weeks earlier than we anticipated. Uh, you showed up and spent a whole day with us when we were in a chaotic and just sleep deprived state. Brayden and Andrea, you two make an incredible team. We love you both so much. We are at home when we're with you. And we're so excited to be part of your next chapter. Cheers everyone. <laughs> <laughs> 